it is opening day of duck season. Big duck season, not just going after teal, but right now, if it flies, it dies. <laughs> I'd finish. God, it makes me excited to see big ducks, you know what I mean? That decoy's gone. There, it. Oh, she stepped on you? it. There hey. she got it. Good girl, Lucy. Whatever you want. The hashies cooked to perfection. How's that? Is that it? Yeah. No. Mm -hmm. No, I don't believe it. Welcome back. It is opening day of duck season. Big duck season. Not just going after teal, but right now, if it flies, it dies. We just pulled up, getting unloaded, getting the gear on. You guys all dressed good. You're not naked. That's, huh? I got clothes on. Do you? Oh, that's unfortunate. So, we're ready to head out there and get the spread put out. We're going to be in a pit line right at Jake's place. As you can see, it is really cold today. This is the coldest day of the year. It's like the first cold front. So there hasn't been a whole lot of ducks yet. We're hoping that they flew weast last night and are here today. That's kind of the plan. Come here, Luce. What are you doing? Oh, get it out. There it is. Get it out. You got it. Yep. Better better here than the pit blind, I always say. Oh! Pre-breakfast. Look, look at that. Look at that. Jeez. Glorious. Hash brown, sausages in there. We're this is why this is why Banjo's on breakfast duty. He's always, he's got that dialed. You I don't know, know what I'm how I'm not 300 pounds. Yeah, the, the, dude, he, Banjo, Banjo's dialed on the old breakfast. And as you guys know, everything you see in today's video is available at DucksWaterfall.com. And we're actually doing a huge giveaway right now for the shirt of the month. If you subscribe, every month that you're subscribed is an entry to win a hunt with either myself, Cole, or Bobby Guy. You get to pick your favorite YouTuber to go on a hunt with. If you want to come hunt with us, all you got to do is go sign up for the shirt of the month and you get entered to win. We're going to select one of you guys at the end of the year to come out and go on a hunt. Like I said, it's going to be of your choice. It's either going to be in Kansas, Nebraska, or Texas. Any other gear, including this little fuzzy thing right here, okay? New backwoods camo hoodie. The calls are going to be blowing. Lucy. You got it. Collar she's wearing. Okay, the vest she's wearing. We've also got some decoy gloves because we need them right now oh, God, today yeah. when it's cold. We got some? Look at these. Look at that. Yeah. Staying nice and waterproof and warm. That's important oh, on a day like today. Those. Yeah. I got my buck gloves on right now. How's that going to go? I'll switch to the ducks one. I see what he's yeah. saying. Gotcha. Yeah. So, anyways, like I said, ducksquarterfile.com. We'll link on the description down below if you guys want to go check it out. Everything you see in today's video will be ducks if you guys want to buy it check it out link down below like i said if you want to come hunting with us subscribe to the shirt of the month you get a brand new shirt every single month and it's exclusive design it's a one of one we don't ever sell it again and i'll actually pop up the design for this month right here so if you guys like this shirt you pick it up get a chance to enter to come hunt with us anyways like i said go to ducksworthfile.com if you guys want to get geared up we're gonna go ahead and get some waders on and get zipped up i'm looking forward to dropping some birds and eating some good breakfast and watching lucy hopefully do good things I'd finish. God, it makes me excited to see big ducks, you know what I mean? I'll tell you what. Yeah, them are nice. Dude, my hands would be cold right now. Like, I'm not, it is, that's the other thing too. The first time it's cold, like, wait till December, I'll be out here in a t-shirt. All right, right now, hell no. We've got the backwoods camo long sleeve, like the thin one. It turns me into a ninja, okay, this guy. And then I've got the thermal base layer. Then I've got the backwoods hoodie. Then I got this freaking sheep or sheep or something. It's really warm. You're layered up. <laughs> I layered up, and I'm actually pretty warm. But I will say, having these gloves on makes it to where you can do this. Keep right now it's 32 degrees. It's pretty, it's pretty incredible. Plus, you can actually move. Like a lot of decoy gloves that I always get, they're too big, okay? And you can't actually like do anything. And I end up just taking them off. You saw I was able to untangle all that, no problem. Keeps your fingers nice and warm. Feels pretty good. Lucy's got her little thermal vest on. And her collar. She, Lucy, she get lost some weight. That thing's a little big on her. It is. She that was yeah. thick Lucy, last year. Downsize you. Last year she fit pretty good, but she actually lost some weight. Who forgot to charge the battery? I plugged it in last night. Really? Is it really not? Hang on. It's, I literally charged it last night. Oh, big goose guy, huh? Well, here's the thing. I plugged them both in. 
And one of them had a green light, one of them had a red light. So my guess is the one that had the green light was probably this one. Yeah, it, 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 it didn't charge. Can you grab that battery out of there? Well, at least at least we got one. I mean, one's better. Is it turning? Well, actually, no, dude. I tur I flipped them both, and they actually worked last night. Huh. So what's the, what what's going on there? Why does it look like That's, he's coming apart? Yeah, yeah, it is coming apart. You mean, right do you mean to figure this out? Yeah, I'm not a doctor. I'll take a look. At it. Might be might be down one so one soldier. Huh. He's, he's MIA. I think. Bad battery or something? I don't know. I, last night I flipped them both, and they both worked, and then I plugged them in. That's all I did. I'm confused. Yeah, yeah that don't make much sense. One will work. Jesus, not like that. <laughs> Good lord, buddy. <laughs> we can fix it. Still broken. Huh? So we can fix it. Don't bust it's it up. Late. Are we putting honkies out? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. You just slaughtered that. So every once in a while, he's got to show who's boss. It'll work. Not today, though. Not today. Nope. I already lost my gloves. <laughs> what happened? Banjo steal them? I think Banjo took them. Comment down below right now. Duck guy or goose guy? Big Junior, what do you think? Goose. What do you think the comment's gonna be? Goose or duck? If they're smart, geese. Big Junior's a huge goose guy. I don't I don't dislike geese. I love geese over water. Geese Bug. over water's better than anything over water's better than it in the field. See, that's wrong too. <laughs> field or water, duck or goose. I'm curious what you guys think. Like honkers doing it over water, I get excited. Not that I don't get excited over a field, but I'm just a water guy. I grew up water hunting, but we always give Big Junior some flack because he's always excited about the geese. We only care about the ducks. Coots in the field are my favorite. That's optimal. Field coots. That's, yeah. o that's yeah. optimal is field coots. Freshies, boys. Freshies. Whole case, Banjo. Locking and loaded. We got, what, five minutes? What's, ban what's he doing over here? I'm cutting this up. Look, he's, he's just chefing it up. You see that? And what, what else? Big Junior brought these, right? Yeah, he's a big nutty guy. A nut hole? Yeah, Joy's nut hole. You big nut hole guy or no? Yeah, is this like a new? Is this a new thing? A nut hole? Yeah. It's got an almond in the middle. Is it really? <laughs> oh. It does have some nuts on the outside. Oh, it's a crunchy donut. Down. It's like a six out of ten. I just heard a teal out there. Oh, really? That's yeah, dry. Oh my god. Lucy wants one. That's more dry. That's worse than a moon pie. Hey, what are you thinking, Ray? <laughs> Back it up, Lucy. You, You're in the shot. Hey, <laughs> hey, you ain't getting no birds yet. Oh my god, that is just heaven. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Here, ducky, ducky. Yeah, let it, let it waft. They always like that. If we don't see birds for a while, we brought back up. Because this always does work. You excited? Alright, I'll give you a little Danish. There's more where this comes from. If, 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 if you bring me the birds. Alright, you guys say tuned. Sacrifice the decoys? <laughs> They're just deal decoys. Oh, yeah! They're just deal decoys. They'll be fine. Here comes another one. Hang on. There's Stop. another Woody. There's a Woody to the right. There he goes. To the left. Shoot him in the gap. That oh. decoy's gone. Yeah. <laughs> she gone. <laughs> listen, we had a gap. The goose decoy? The goose. That's I, listen, expensive. I'll, yeah. Listen, I'll make it right, all right? <laughs> Anything in the name of getting the first bird of the season, okay? Listen, he was in the gap. The goose was not. But the pattern went weast, I think. The goose was also in the gap. The goose may or may not have been in that gap. I gotta go get that that goose. That's 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 that one's getting mounted. I feel like the yeah, decoy is. Shot. Yeah, that's a good shot. Rip. Back, back. Come on, fetch up, Lou. Fetch up, fetch. I think she sees it now. There it is. There it. Oh, she stepped on you? it. She fell. There hey! she got it. Good girl, Lucy. Yeah, I'm gonna. Do you want to go grab that decoy? Go grab that. Yeah, see what the damage is. I think he's headless. No, I think his head's gone. Yeah. Yeah. Good girl, Lucy. You can take that one up with the boss. Yeah, I'll, I'll listen. I'll, <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll make it right. How's that? Hey man, she's doing just. Is he all right? <laughs> no. Some, can you hear it? No. There's no. no BBs in Wait, this. is he really that? Is he fine? Because he got small. Oh, a little dense, but she all right. It's better than I expected, to be honest with you. A couple little, couple little packs in there, but oh yeah, yeah, there might be a few. Yeah, there's a couple in the head. <laughs> what, is he, what we got, a little greeny? A little greeny. Sheesh! 
You want to back out? First, oh, yeah. yeah, put him back in the spread. That's, yeah, our that's a lucky the, decoy now. Yeah, maybe put, don't put it right in front of That me. was big junior. Sorry. The shooting oh, yeah. hole. Yeah, that was. Sure was. <clears throat> I was worried about the two floating teal decoys, and he moved, and you're like, he's in the gap. I was like, you. All right. You were worried about the ten dollar decoy, not the fifty dollar decoy. Yeah. yeah, I worried about the wrong decoy. <laughs> Nothing says big duck season like a freaking teal. But yep, hey, that's on par. I was gonna say that's pretty typical. Honestly, greenies though, I like greenies. They, they get the they get the pass. Okay, I like them. Lucy, what do you think? Did you, yeah, did you, was that a little tough to find that sucker? <laughs> we came in about eight minutes before shooting night and sat there and swam around. We waited to see if there's any other birds. You know, in my opinion, it's not a bad idea to have a little live decoy action going around. But nothing else came in, so he and the goose decoy got the old wham bam. I wouldn't have killed him on that pass with the lids wide open. Yeah. Like, I don't think he's going to do it yeah. again. <laughs> I, I know. He, well, he got right over the top of us. And I was like, should we come? Because I don't know oh, if he's going to do anything else. scared me so bad at the goal card. Big Junior goes, really? <laughs> yeah, he really? He like, You're like, kill him. For real? I mean, we're sitting here with the pit yeah. wide open. I was like, yeah. he's probably not going to do it again. Now, he, once he's got right over, he's like, should I kill him? You're like, sure. Big Junior, really? <laughs> <laughs> okay. yeah. Me and Badger started hitting him with the old wham, bam. That did it. Send the panther. Let's see what happens. Fetch up. Fetch up. Chicken. Fetch up. Ooh. You. Yeah, I'm. I don't know if she knows where it's at though. She's on the on the way though. Yeah, I might need to go help her out. Lucy, fetch. That's not what I pointed. Here, here, here. Sit, 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 sit. Ready? Fetch. There she's on. She ran that line. She's on it. Look at that line. She. What a pro. Fetch up. Dude, look at that. She's pissed. Fetch up. Here. She doesn't want to. Hey. That's it, Lucy. Lucy, she, dude, she's protesting. Poor girl hates geese. Hey, fetch up here, here. Fetch, fetch. Dude, she's. Refusing. I think you might have to get your goose. Hey, fetch, fetch. Get that goose here. Good girl. He, no, oh, dude, she's really. She refusing. hates it. You're kidding me. Hey, get that bird. It's on land get too. Get that bird. Fetch up. Dude, you're kidding me. Here, fetch, fetch. Yeah, yeah. Fetch up. Yeah. Here, here. She don't know how to drag this Yeah, thing. Lizzie. Here, here. <laughs> oh, that, she gave that, up. Get that bird. <laughs> She's you like, don't absolutely get not. Fetch up. Here. You're a grown dog. Get that bird. Here. Fetch up. Fetch up. Fetch. Here. Here. Get that bird. Fetch up. Fetch up. It's a big old honker, though. It is a big one, yeah. Get that bird. Lose fetch. Fetch up. Right here. No, you... This one. Get the bird. Fetch. Come on. Fetch up. Fetch up. Fetch up. Fetch up. Come on. Good job. Come on, girl. Good Come job. On, girl. Fetch up. Yeah, right fetch there. Up. Right fetch there. Up. Here. 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 Yeah. Step. Come on. Here. Fetch. She, she don't like it. She don't like it. it. <laughs> That's on you now. No bands, boys. Yeah, she is not a goose dog. In the water, I don't think she minds because she just couldn't float some. Like push it. Yeah. A heavy this goose. Sucker's dense, dude. She's not a she's not a big dog, but we got one honk daddy down. A little lonesome guy come floating in. We're blaming the weathermen. They said blowing 25 out of the north. Oh, another goose, another goose, another goose. Goose. Get close, get close. Alright boys, we're gonna make the block for no reason. That sucker kept on moving. But got a little greenie and a honker. Them suckers are just silent. They, they yeah, come over. They just, just one-off yeah. silent little sucker. So we got the the lid on now, so we'll be a little bit more concealed. It's still cold out. Wind's definitely blowing from the south. Now I'm watching the fog, which is not the direction that we set up for, or the direction that the weatherman said. But it's, it's still early. It's still really early. We're gonna need some magic to happen here. You guys, stay tuned. <laughs>
whatever you want. Yeah, buddy. Lucy, your favorite. Yeah, dude. He done did it dirty. Well, we had a few geese circle around for five, six minutes. We ended up moving some decoys. Just got back in the blind and that little lonesome guy, he done did it pretty good. Lucy, what are you gonna think about this guy? We gotta get you to be a goose dog here and come home, Big Junior. Lucy. Yep, you see him. You see him. Get him, girl. Get him. Fetch up. Bring him here. Come on. Here. Here. Fetch up. Fetch up. Fetch up. You got it. You got it. You got it. Here. Lucy, fetch. No. No. No, Lucy. No. Come on, girl. Come on. Bring him here. 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 Yeah, here. Let's go. Good Come job. on, Lucy. Come Yay. on, Lucy. Come on, Lucy. Come on, girl. You got it. Come on. That's come a on. big old goose. Come on, girl. Good girl. Good job. Yeah, it's a good girl. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No bands. It's a, it's a honky kind of day, you know what I'm saying? I guess. Lucy's pissed about it. She at least put some effort into that. She one. did good. That, that was just, better. She just doesn't know how to pick it up. I don't think got the neck strength or what, but Buddy came just. You, you just move those back. You just put a family group Look behind us. Move the spread and glide right in. We're going to be eating good now. The two, two, two of them. Yeah, killed them. He's out. That was bad shooting on my part for sure. Get him, Lucy. Get him. Get him, Lucy. Here. Fetch up. Here. Good girl. Get that bird. Woo! Got him, boys. <laughs> that sucker. Good girl, Lucy. Buddy was a little mobile, wasn't he? He was mobile. Well, more honkers down. What are we going to make? I don't know. We got a lot of meat now. We're going to be feasting up, boys. Speaking of feasting, it's almost breakfast time. Sheesh! Oh, you got him. Let's oh, go. Him. Look at him. This sucker is a world traveler. Really? Yeah, he's mobile as hell. He started to hunker down. Lucy got after him. He tried flying. Nice. Swamp, nothing for that swamp panther, though. We're, We're eating good, Banjo. We can come up with a good recipe. Oh, yeah. We got a bunch of meat. Bam! Got the old Ducks PVC waterproof dry bag to only to secure the goods. Only the best. We went real lightweight on the cooking utensils. Efficiently packed. Okay. Paper towels. Some forks, plates, butter. What we got here? Some Criole. Oh, there's a snake inside that burner. Oh, oh, oh ha! Grab, ah. grab, grab that. Come here, Rick. Hey. Come here, Rick. Don't burn yourself. Yay! <laughs> Look out. What are you talking about? Is it going to bite? No. Hey, is it going to uh, bite? bite me? Is it a garter snake? No. He was in the burner. Catch and cook? Right up at Junior. Catch and cook. See ya. See you later, Rick. All right, burners, hot binge. What we got? What we got cooking? Some patties. I've never had this. Hash brown patties. In a sack. The old sack of patties, yeah. huh? All right, standard oven toaster. Right up. And then what else we got? Johnsonville. Already cooked. I made it easy for you. Look, you put look them on there. Look at you. Yeah. And once the butter starts getting nice and hot, we'll go ahead and throw those patties on. Cook them patties. They'll cook some sausage. Hopefully, the ducks smell it. Because we haven't seen any ducks. One Tilio. Oh yeah, boys. Lucy's interested. <laughs> Lucy! All right, we'll make one for you, Lucy. We won't leave you hanging. The smell. Something about it, boys. Just hits different. Banjo. What? You already take a bite. <laughs> I'm not gonna take a bite. <laughs> what the hell's that, Rick? You tell me your looks like your teeth went right through the center of that sucker. Right? That's Lucy's. <laughs> Ready? Let him go all the way. 
Shoot him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Can I get a oh, yeah? There you go. Swim out. Just rack their head. They're both swimming. They're both swimming. Go, Big Junior. Go, 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 go. Run down there and shoot them. That one's going to run up the bank. Banjo, get on the other side. You got him? Big Junior found him? Oh, we got that dog. You got Big Junior on duty. Is he dead? No, man. Yeah, he's just laying there. Huh? Oh, he just got in the grass and died. We thought he made it out. Yeah. He said, see you later, pal. I figured like Lucy, that. she's against the geese, I'm telling you. Yep. She intentionally won't find them. She don't want to pick them up. Two more honkers. Is that for the... Oh, I forgot what the hash he's on. Oh, rip. We going. better go check yeah, on those. Go. Don't worry, boys. The hashies cooked to perfection oh, while we were chasing yeah. the geese. <laughs> there it is, boys. Original recipe, fully cooked breakfast sausage. Delicious. Banjo, your meat's cooked. Well, it was already cooked, technically. Really? It's warm. Yeah. You look good. Hot meat. Just for you, pal. Come down, Big Junior. No. Lucy. Lucy. No, Big Junior. All right. You try that sausage? Stick that in your mouth. The sausage is probably hot. real hot. It's really hot. Try the hash, hash brown first. I think it's been out for like 10 minutes. Oh, I heard a crunch. Mm hmm. The crunch is good. You double decorating banjo? What do you mean? You, make, you want me to make a sandwich? Is that what you're saying? I don't know. There's just Sammy? Extra, there's an extra hashy, so I went for it. Oh. This is what Andrew wanted me to do. Really? That's innovative. Wow, that's a that's a boy meal right there, Banjo. Yeah. Like that? Yeah. How's that? Is Not that it? Move. Yeah. No. Mm -hmm. No. I don't believe it. All right, I'm going to have to try it. I also have to go with an, an open face. Open too. face. How, how, is that thing not hot? My fingers are burnt. Them wieners? Are they hot? I'd use the hash brown port so you can grab it. That thing is smoldering hot. I don't know how you're sticking that in your mouth. Mmm. That's pretty good. Yeah. You weren't lying. This may or may not give you a heart attack, but... Mmm. Mm-hmm. I like that. A little hashy. Weenie Sammy? Yeah. Where's that yellow dog at? She's my banjo. Lucy, you need a bite? I got you. You got her? Mm-hmm. Good girl. Even though <laughs> I protested them geese, I don't blame it. Geese are kind of annoying. We like them, but they just tend to. Well, it also doesn't help. There's no wind. But they be, they be scared. But anyways, breakfast is served. The fragrance of breakfast worked once. Hopefully, we can get another group in. You guys stay tuned. Shoo! Oh, we didn't see any more birds, ladies and gentlemen. We got the decoys all picked up. We got them nice, delicious geese sitting right over there. And it is time to take them home. And on the drive, we got a, about an hour drive. We're going to think of some type of recipe. Hopefully something we've never done before. But since we shot so many geese, we've got a lot of meat to work with. Sometimes these catch because we've got one or two teals. So we got to be kind of like careful with what dish we make. We're going to have a ton of meat, whether we want to grind it up, whether you want to do something like a sausage or a pastrami of some sort. Like we've got tons of options. Could even just make a huge batch of goose jerky. So we're going to drive home, we're going to figure it out, and we're going to get to cook it. You guys stay tuned. You give us a tutorial or what? Hey Junior, you give us a tutorial. Let's see it. You're the, he's the goose god. I feel like yeah. you got you to gotta tell people. So we're going to put this on uncut. You guys know you can't see it on YouTube, yeah. but this is how you clean a goose for those of you guys that do not know. So if you're on YouTube, we'll see you guys in the kitchen. Shoo! Alrighty, folks, time to cook them geese. We are headed to Walmart and we've kind of made the decision. We're like, we got, again, I want to try something different. It's like we've only got so many catch and cooks throughout the season. We've done this for so many years. We got to keep coming up with new and innovative things. Now, this one, it's new and it's innovative, but is it complicated? No. It's actually very simple, Banjo. Like, I probably like one of the more simple, I which, like and if it's good, if it's good, it's always good for you guys because you guys are probably a lot like me. And, you're not trying to freaking go chef it up like crazy to make a good meal. Kind of like mm -hmm. a college meal. Yeah, it's not like, really a struggle say, meal, but it's yeah, just you like got a struggle meal, college meal, and then a boy meal. Yeah, I feel like we're we're in between probably college and yeah. struggle. Yeah. It's yeah. not quite a boy meal. Like a, if you guys don't know a boy meal. Boy meal is like steak, Only steak and that's yeah. it. Like you don't have sides or nothing, just steak in like a glass of something, chocolate milk or a beer. That's that's a that's a boy meal. Okay. This is probably right below a college meal. I would say it's a little bit better than a struggle meal, but we've never had it before. 
and we are gonna take the geese, we've got them cleaned up, and we've got them cut into strips and put in the freezer to help grind them because we're gonna end up just making some ground goose and turning it into hamburger helper. When's the last time you ate hamburger helper? 2014, I don't know. Huh, that's really recent actually. 2014, that's like yeah. 10 years ago. Yeah, but recent. I, that's still pretty, like I still, I was like, seven, like I was probably 17. 2040. Like I probably haven't had this since I was seven. This is it's probably I haven't had this in like probably 20 years. Yeah, I probably haven't. Well, had I, since I was like isn't that weird to say I haven't had that in 20 years? God, I'm yeah, old. Yeah, old. I'm getting too old for this. In fact, I said 2014, and then you said you're 17. You're old. Yeah, I was 17 in 2014. Yeah, so I'm talking child, like six, seven, maybe eight years old was the last time I had this. So it's been almost 20 years since I've had hamburger helper. It's in that aisle. Uh, pasta, probably. That's where I would probably guess if I was a hamburger helper buying son of a gun. I just, like everyone always makes fun of it, but I feel like low key is actually kind of fire, so. Oh God, yeah, dude, they have a lot. Look at the variety. Wow, really? We got cheeseburger macaroni, double cheeseburger macaroni, stroganoff, okay, cheesy Italian shells, four cheese lasagna, chicken fried rice, cheesy tuna cheesy pasta. Oh, really? <laughs> What's this? This is just three cheese. Just some three cheese. Okay, so okay, Banjo, I got an idea. What's up? You pick. I also realize how cheap that is. No wonder I ate it growing up. Yeah, this all makes yeah, sense I now because it's so cheap. You pick one and I pick one. Okay. We've got enough meat. We'll make two and we'll figure out whose is better. So I'll let you get. You get first dibs. You pick any of them that you want. This makes sense why I ate this as a kid. It's because it's freaking two dollars for an entire meal. Huh? I can tell you which one I'm not. Potato picking. stroganoff. Yeah. yeah. I I don't that know, I would never pick. Yeah, tuna cheesy Ew. pasta. That's disgusting. You're a big tuna guy, though. Yeah, you like tuna, though. Not in all. Cheesy. <laughs> all right, let's all right, see. All right. Which one? Which one do you think is gonna be the best? I feel like you can't go wrong with, with cheesy, cheesy Italian, Italian shells. shells. It says try with ground sausage instead of ground beef, which we've got ground goose. So maybe we gotta make a little bit of a. They, it, yeah. So maybe what's, get, what's the difference? Twin pack. Yeah, I think. Oh, that's we it. don't need. Yeah, you, you don't, don't need the twin. You don't need one. This one's got real cheese. Oh, real cheese. That's good. Okay, so. He's going with like more of a cheesy. So I'm like, okay, so I don't know, four cheese lasagna could be the deal. Lasagna is pretty solid. We've had some like, I don't know what we've made. We've ground stuff up yeah. and made in lasagna, which is pretty good. Cheese enchilada wouldn't be too bad. Stroganoff? Tomato basil penne? You got though? your cheeseburger mac and cheese. Really? Yeah. Or, or just a, I feel like I ate beef pasta growing up. Like, I feel like that's a pretty, like, I, anytime I think of hamburger helper, I think of that dish. I don't know why. Maybe, yeah. I, I don't know. I just, I feel like I Pop don't remember. was about it. I don't remember any of these other ones. Because this isn't cheesy, right? This would just be like. Yeah, it's more, it's a different sauce. I don't know what it'd be. What would be the, what would be the, the flavoring? It's more like Beef. a. Yeah. I feel like, because yours is cheesy, right? Yeah. yeah. Those are different enough, do you think? Or do you I think, think so. Or do you think I should go lasagna? What do you think the difference between lasagna? you should go enchilada. You think enchilada with rice? That. I don't even understand. Like, I don't, what part of this makes it an enchilada? There's nothing There's about nothing it that. About it, yeah. It's just like the filling, and then you yeah. eat it. But it's, it's like more like Mexican style. I mean, you're right. There could be some good seasoning flavors in here. Philly cheesesteak. Oh, what, what's Velveeta skillet? What's going on there, huh? What about this one? Tomato basil. Yeah. Really? Oh, that one does. That doesn't good. sound that good. Or that doesn't sound bad. What's going on there? Should we? Should we? Should we get Philly Velveeta? Philly cheesesteak. Yeah, I didn't even know that was an option. No, Philly cheesesteak would be good, it. but I feel like we we gotta just stick to he actually hamburger stick helper. Brand. So yeah. yeah. Little glove. Remember him? Yeah, Little yeah, yeah. I remember. I remember, buddy. He used to rip around. So four yeah, cheese, yeah. lasagna. So I'm thinking, okay, yeah, lasagna. Let me, we'll, we'll lay them out here. Cheesy enchilada, tomato basil, beef pasta. Those are probably the three. What's going on there? Um, some beef stew. Really? That looks disgusting. <laughs> I say there's also beef stroganoff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Throw that down here. Should I go ask? Look, I can go ask somebody. Pick a helper anywhere else. Try to do that. See yeah. what he says. And then I like, narrow it down to two and then you can pick one. Yeah. All right. How's it going, David? Good. Question for you. Yeah. You big hamburger helper guy? Do, uh, do you eat hamburger? That's a lot. I don't. You don't really eat it? Oh, man. You think, Mike, you think Michael eats meat? Should I go talk to Michael? Yeah. All right. I'll Question for you, Michael. Do you, sure. you ever eat hamburger helper? I have. Okay. You have a you have a, a preference between these four. We're trying to decide what we want to do. We've got beef stroganoff, beef no, pasta, no. tomato no, basil no. penne, or cheesy enchilada. Cheesy enchilada is pretty good. Really? Oh. All right, I'll, I'll take your word for it. I appreciate that. Big cheesy enchilada guy. All right, cheesy enchilada. Yeah, that's what Michael says. So, so it's just add meat. Like they probably have seasonings and everything. They right? got instructions. Yeah. So yeah. cup of water, cup of milk, and one pound of ground beef for topping. For topping, you need milk. Hot water and milk. Wow, yours is even more simple than mine. Yeah. 
All right. This going to be the cheapest catch cut we've ever done. Yeah. This is like $2. This is great. I like that. You guys stay tuned. Chew! Look at that meat. How you doing? Wonderful. You ready? Oh, yeah. You missed it. But you, if you were here, this really nice guy named Mike. Was it Michael? Michael. Not David. David didn't eat meat. Yeah, David didn't eat meat. Michael ate meat, and Michael highly suggested the cheesy enchilada, which is my dish. And Banjo, one of the cheesy Italian shells made with real cheese. My favorite. I feel like that's gonna be way better. The, the shells. Yeah. Then the enchilada. Yeah. I mean, me and Michael are on a team. But look at all this meat. Goose, 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 and there's a teal in there as well. But then what we did was we sliced it up, not thin, just just with a knife, and then froze it for like a couple hours while we were at Walmart hanging out. And that's a tip I got from you guys that said it's going to be easier to grind it up. So this stuff is going in the freezer, but I want to show you. This is how we store our meat. And then we labeled it 10-7 goose. So then we know. So now we got plenty of meat that we can, you know, keep and we can divide, cock or whatever. And then when we want to have a big jerky day, we thaw these suckers out and make jerky out of it. But in case you guys are like new to hunting and have a bunch of meat, don't put them in Ziplocs because then you'll get freezer burn. Get these little sucky machines and do that. I'm saying you, you know your way around anyways let's go ahead and turn this grinder on we haven't used this one yet this year the last one we used is the cheap Walmart one wow this is a thin hole all right you guys said frozen's better we're about to find out oh that's actually grinding pretty fine because a lot of times it gets mushy if it's not frozen that's pretty yeah. I feel like that's pretty good all right I'll start listening right, to you all guys right. all right I, I got it you guys got it dialed. You guys know your way around a grinder here. What are yep. you using for the filler at the end? I didn't bring anything. Big Junior's if, hand? If it's frozen, I feel like you might not need much oh. of a filler. I think that's kind of the idea. Oh, okay. There's a, that was a pallet. Did you hear that? Yeah, it yeah. definitely hit metal in there somewhere. She gone. Yeah, dude, this is, I like this. This is grinding up nice. So we need, technically, I think two pounds total. Yep. Which is probably going to be about right. Pound per breast? Pound per breast is kind of what, yeah. what I thought. So I threw got, all the tendies in there, too. Come on. There it is. I think the frozen so far is... It's a strat. It's been good. You just gotta make sure you, you did good on the cutting, because the cutting, if you cut a little too wide, we'd be we'd, be we'd be in trouble, yeah. Keep going, boys. Yeah. Yeah, easy, easy. Yeah. Alright, that guy's have to thaw out. This is one goose, isn't that crazy? Yeah. One goose. Them honkers. They got some freaking meat to them, boys. I'll tell you what. Alright, every once in a while you need a nice plunge. Look at, I feel like wow. that looks really good. Yeah, I'm impressed. I'm about it. All right, so now I gotta figure out. Uh, there there it you is. go. Uh, under the bank off. Uh, there you go. Huh? <laughs> you just have something to say over there? Yeah. <laughs> huh? <laughs> there it is. Final plunge, boys. I don't know if frozen's the way. It might have been a little too frozen. <laughs> I think it might have been. Yeah, they can bound her up. That's Dang, I've never bound up a... I mean, that's plenty. That's way more than two pounds, I feel like, right? So we've got this thing. This thing's heating up. I'm just going to kind of eyeball it. Okay, that's probably a half pound. So. Yeah, this, yeah. Thing's, this stuff's pretty lean. I'm guessing that's maybe a pound. I don't know. We might be all right. All right, so we got we got two pounds in there. There's a little bit of oil in the bottom. So we're gonna let this thing get nice and browned up. And then, let's see, Banjo, what are your ingredients? Cook, cook meat in 10 inch skillet over medium for six to eight. Great drain. Okay, stir in hot water, milk, sauce packets, and pasta. Heat to a, were you telling me you don't have to cook the pasta first? Or you boil it all together, the sauce and everything. In the, the meat? Yeah. That's yeah. weird, I feel yeah, like, no? We just cook it all Excuse together. Excuse me. Are you, what are you Straight doing? Straight from the tit, are you out of your godforsaken? <laughs> God dang, dude. So like you cook the meat and then you add a ton of water and boil the meat with the noodles. Why don't you just cook the noodles si like separately and mix it? You do whatever you want. Reduce heat, rest. cover, simmer 25 minutes. Stirring occasionally until pasta is tender. If necessary, uncover and cook while stirring for additional one to 25 minutes. I think the purpose is supposed to be just a one pan. Is that, the, is that, the, is that the idea? Yeah. Okay, mine, we've got cook, yep, same thing. Stir in hot water, milk, sauce, and rice. So yours is noodles, mine's rice. Heat to boil. And then simmer. So we'll, one of us will ha can use that, and then oh yeah, I think that'll be yeah. Yep. That should be good. So you can pretty much do it all in one thing, and then you can just pour half of it out and add. And then just add my ingredients at your. Yeah, I think that's pretty it's solid. Dumb. So all right, boys. Well, you can see she's already starting to get already starting to get a little bit brown. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it up just a little bit. Mix it up. Oh yeah, look at that. I mean, it just looks like ground beef. You gonna season the ground beef or not? They say not to, but I definitely feel like some yeah. all meat. 
would not hurt my feelings no. personally in a situation like this. I feel like like this is this is necessary. Yeah. Just just for just just to help curve the fact that we're using goose and not. And it's even. You're putting it on both. True. So it's not like it does even it up a little bit. Yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and get this completely browned up. We're ready to rock and roll. Divide it, conquer it. And we're gonna see whose dish is superior. You guys take it. Sheesh! Look at that, boys. What do you think? Taster. You really getting after it? All naked and everything, huh? That's good. Uh -huh. I like ground goose. That's really good. That's pretty good. Like, there's a little bit of wang to it, but it's in a good way. I, I like the like. wang. Yeah, the wang's pretty good in that mm -hmm. one. Big wang guy. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and try to divide this in half the best we can. Go ahead and spoon this on on over. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. This is why I have my own kitchen, guys. Can't have anything nice. I do like it's just enough wang. It's yeah. enough wang to realize I shot this son. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Like I did this. Yep. But it's not enough wang where you're like, yeah. Gee, what, what's going on here? So I think it's pretty good. You like that? Look about right. Yeah. Jeez, that, that thing's pretty loud. So I need. Okay, let me read this. Stir in hot water, milk, sauce mix, rice, and heat to a boil. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn this on. How you work this thing, mister? Turn, yep, hold it. Nope, sorry, we're off. Whole thing's off. <laughs> the whole thing's off, then you gotta unlock it. Type in your passcode, give it your social security, then you turn it on, and then we're gonna turn it on high because we are going to boil. That was getting after yeah, it. Yeah, now it's making sense. All right, so one in a, or two, sorry, two in a quarter cup. This is hot water, in case you're curious. This stuff acts quick. That's one cup, okay. Two cup, okay, and a quarter, sure, about a quarter, right, what do you need? You got, you got it, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's, yeah, that was my three-fourths. What was it? That's two and a half. half. Yeah, what are you at now? Another half. That's they one were good. Three one and three quarter. Yeah. Okay, I, I'm gonna, I gotta add a cup of milk, okay. Oh, I got more milk than you. Really? Yep. God. That just looks horrible. This is disgusting. Yeah. God, we didn't even try it yet. Our Did you eat this growing up? Hamburger Helper? Yeah. 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 What, 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 do you, what's do you know the last why? year you had Hamburger Helper? Yeah, when did you last year? I don't know, a long time ago. Five years ago? Like 2014? Or sure, like, yeah, 2014. We'll I said 2014. I was 17. I had the last time I had this, I was probably seven. It's 20 years ago. I was, I was 12 in 2014. Yeah, so you may, you may have eaten this. The reason why we, do you, read, you know why we ate this? Two bucks, the whole it's thing. $2. Yeah, <laughs> now with inflation, dude. Wow. Back in the day, it's probably eighty-nine cents. All right, then add the sauce mix and the rice. I feel like that's not very much rice to meat to meat ratio. Rice wise, I guess. <clears throat> All right, add the. You gotta dig for this. Your you put it at the bottom. You know, like treasure hunt. What are you doing? Can you put the? You're putting them in now. Yeah. All right, it's <laughs> in. Go for it. Yeah. There's no idea. I right. put the, this packet at the bottom. Real cheese. Yeah, in a sack. Why do you think I have two packets here? Because yours makes more. But, but I'm saying, like, but is it two of the same or are they different, do you think? Sauce mix, what's that? What's your say? Topping. Let Wait, me hang on. Yeah, I probably want to put the topping on. I'm glad. What's it say? Topping? I, is topping later? I imagine. They're saying real cheese. So you, you make the sauce, I bet. Yeah. Okay, I'm glad I read that. This is sauce mix. There it is. Okay, this looks like taco seasoning. I'm about it. It's not. It doesn't look terrible. Yeah, that's a that's a prison meal there, buddy. That yeah. Oh yeah. Nice. So that, we we probably left out a oh, yeah. prison meal, struggle meal, college, college meal, meal, and boy, boy, boy meal. meal. Yeah. <laughs> we were rating it. We said this is probably between college and boy meal. It might mine might be dropping to prison. And you, yours looks struggle. like a prison. Your, yours looks like a prison meal. Reduced to a simmer for 20 minutes, stirring occasionally until rice is tender. If necessary, uncover and cook, and then top, remove the heat, and add the topping. Which for topping, it's three tablespoons of milk mixed with a topping packet. Do you have topping? I ain't got no topping. Yeah, I'm superior already. I, I, I got toppings. I think this is gonna be better. You think so? I think mine's gonna have more flavor because mm -hmm. it's more like cheesy enchilada. Like cheesy enchilada, like enchiladas are thick. Bam! They got yeah. they got seasoning to it. Yeah. Yours is just noodles. Yeah, mine's boiling. You want to turn it down? Yeah, go for it. That looks like a simmer, doesn't it? I mean, yeah, it's, that's it's, it's doing something. All right, Occur occasionally stirring. 20 minutes. Covered. 20 minutes. You guys stay tuned. Yeah. How's that looking? Oh, yeah. That's Hamburger helper, huh? Cheese. Are you going to serve some up? Yep. Big Everybody. Junior. 
Between prison food, struggle meal, or college meal, where do you think this ranks? It's like college meal. Though, okay, all right. All right. We're on the same good. page. I still gotta make sauce. Yeah. What if my sauce is what just takes over the edge? It might be. Dude, this, the fact that this is like $2 is, yeah. is kind of crazy, actually. You made a ton of food for Yeah, that's a bucks. ton of food. It might taste like that, so. You know, it yourself. might. So three tablespoons of milk mixed with this mystery packet. One. That's, that's two. A lot. Feel heavy four. That's three. <laughs> You'll be all right. So this what is the, is this? it just says topping. What do you top your enchilada with? Sauce. Sauce. Like some type of cream sauce, I feel like. I should have smelled Really? It. Is it that bad? Yeah. Yeah, you oh. went so deep. That smells like that's, expired. That's prison. Food. Curdled. This looks like powdered sugar. I don't it's know if not. I, put this yeah, I wish it was powdered sugar. I feel like you gotta taste that first. Stick your tongue in there. Your Would you want to eat that? Not particularly. Like that. Okay. <laughs> what does it taste like? <laughs> like it smelled. <laughs> oh, that's not good. Yeah, that'll be an optional deal there. We're not. We're not man. We're not making that mandatory. We'll do a nice little side-by-side -side comparison here. Presentation, both looks like prison food. No, I don't think one's food. better than another. Oh, the real question is, is there one that you're gonna be able to, you know, ID as goose more than the other? You know, is one gonna cover it up more, or is it gonna be the same? Get in there, get, get a, mm. yeah, you gotta be the big cream guy. <laughs> you're... Nah. You might... <laughs> nah. Like, what even, what are they going <laughs> Like, what are they even going for with it? I don't it? know, it just gets worse as it goes. Why did you, you do that it? much? I don't want to try it. <laughs> I don't want to try it. Like there's, it is, I don't even know what it's trying to do. Because it's just not, there's nothing to it. We got... I'm going to try yours first. I, I think Banjo is going to be better. Wow. All right. <laughs> yeah. He's already made his mind up. What are you going for? Yours? Yeah. All right. Mm, that rice is pretty good, though. Damn. That rice is good. Try that rice real quick. Holy smokes. I... I might have to start eating this more often, though. Yeah, that's pretty good. I feel like he's a cheat code for like lunch. Dude, that is pretty freaking good. What do you think? They're both pretty good. <laughs> James loves it. They are good. You're not a big noodle guy? I will say on mine, the cheese tastes fake. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The cheese is very like... Mm, that Yours cheese. tastes like hammer helper wood, yeah. I feel like. You tell me Michael had something going on with the old enchilada? <laughs> Michael knew something we didn't, you know? Versus mine, if I got it, I, I don't think I would say it's Hamburger Helper. No. You know what I mean? Yeah. You definitely cannot tell either one is Goose at all. No. no. Not even a little no. bit. No. You got your mind made up? I honestly think enchiladas. I'm not going to lie to you. What do you think? I can't even go with mine. Mine's crap compared to yours. Is it? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I was going to say. It's, it's just <laughs> that cheese. The cheese is so fake. Like, like, his taste, like, you, if you're like, do you like Hamburger Helper? You're like, ugh, like noodles yeah. and just nasty Meat. fake stuff. No. But like, mine, if you got served it. At a restaurant, mm -hmm. you I mean you would it tastes like restaurant quality to be honest with you. I think Michael knew what he was yeah. doing. Yeah. Yeah. Versus banjos taste like hamburger helper. It's just like mm -hmm. you know what make yours really, really good? Mm -hmm. Some of those like andouilles in there. Like, um, almost like a gumbo. Mm -hmm. Yours has potential to be like really, really good. My sauce is just terrible. Like the noodles are good, the meat's good, and then you get that sauce taste. Mm-mm. It ain't good. I really like mine. Yeah. Like actually. Like that's mm -hmm. good. And I don't I agree with you. Neither one can you can tell yeah. that it's good. No. I feel like you could whip this up in the blind. Mm -hmm. like you, yeah. you shoot a goose, you just mm -hmm. whip one up right there, you got just, lunch. Just start getting it. I'll eat yours again. I wouldn't, I wouldn't buy that crap. Let's no, you gotta try it. until you think. He's talked a lot of smack on the noodles. Yeah, now, I mean, yeah, it was all right. It looks not ideal. I mean, I still ate mine, but. You always clean your plate. Yeah. And no matter what it is, yeah. you just always clean he's the plate. Bro, he's cleaning up. Oh, yeah. That sauce ain't ideal, man. It just, doesn't it just taste like Hamburger Helper should? You know what else. I mean? I feel like if instead of that cheese packet, you threw like some Kraft mac and cheese. They, they, you'd be a lot better for sure. Really What's the rice got to say versus that in the shells? Oh, we should got tortillas. Yeah, I, I think that's, that's pretty good. Deal. Yeah. Yeah, it's really good. Where's that green sauce? Yo. We might have to get the green sauce going. I mean, I think we, Michael, he, he knows his way around some Hamburger Helper. Because he, I wasn't going to go with it, and I'm glad I went with his suggestion. Dude, honestly, it's pretty good. Which one right here? We're getting some sauce. Really? We're, we're not using that one. We're going with this no. one. No. See, we... That one. You gotta try it. We all try it. We, yeah, you might need to dabble just for, just for, the, just for the fun of it. All right, you gotta try it. Tongue that. punch that bowl right there. Let's see. Hmm? You go ahead. Let's wow. see it. Oh, that was a really big go for that. What, like, what is that? 
What are they trying to do? I think they're trying to go for like sour cream. Yeah, but it's that's not. Just, if I think that if you put that on yours, I might have actually. Won. Yeah, that's, that's how bad yeah, that's yeah. I'm glad I'm glad I just just said no go on that one. Dude, this rice dish is the deal. Yeah, mm-hmm. Clean plate. Sheesh. Every time with this kettle. Wow. Well, for two bucks, you get a whole pot of this stuff. I mean, serving up some more. You want some more? Yeah. You're gonna try that green sauce on there. Wow, look at going for seconds. Look at this. Oh, oh that yeah. Sauce on there. That's a deal. Oh yeah. I'd say this almost is boy meal level. It's. I was gonna say yeah. I think this oh. is this is above a college meal. Yeah. It's pretty good. Like I said, neither one of them. You can't tell it's goose, and that was fresh goose ground with just some all meat on it. We didn't do nothing to it, and it. You could. It I know. It tastes like beef. It tastes just like. You wouldn't. You wouldn't know, Lucy. What do you? I feel like mine will give her the shit. That's the deal, right, Big Junior? What's going on there? Is, is the sauce? Maybe. Oh, yeah. There's a little salsa on there. It's good. All right. Yeah. Sit. Sit. Yeah. Sit. How, what do you think of banjos? You want to try mine? That might be a little hot. You good? How many tail wags? All right. <laughs> Which one's better? She, she likes anything. Well, folks, there you have it. Catch, clean, cook, hamburger helper. It's like almost like a budget meal, I feel like. Just straight ground goose in a $2 box. of ha Not even, it's like $1.80 or something like that. That's pretty, I'm pretty impressed, to be honest with you. I, if you guys like hamburger helper and you have not tried the enchilada, I highly recommend it. If you've never tried a hamburger helper, you gotta try enchilada, then you gotta try banjos. Because the banjos will remind you of what we grew up on a hamburger helper. They didn't have the enchilada stuff when we were young. Because I would have eaten that. I'm used to just noodles, and that's pretty much about it. Second Clean place. Seconds. Yeah. Band well, there you have it, folks. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Remember, everything you guys saw in today's video will be available at duckswaterfowl.com. Link down in the description down below. We'll catch you in peace.